Okay, guys, so today's video I have for you is showing you guys um, how to make a neon slime. So we are going to actually try out this um, five and below acrylic paint. So, yeah, and these have six neons and six metallics. And I did try one of the brown metallics. And it did turn into a purplish metallic color. But if you guys want a video of me making this, comment that comment that down below. And I'll go ahead and make some metallic. But right now, I'm going to see if this slime will make it neon. And we're going to make it neon pink. So, yeah. So this video is going to be called Trying, trying a Fiber Low Acrylic Paint for slime so yeah or something like that but yeah let's just get started and I probably won't be talking probably will in some parts but not all not like mostly so yeah so you guys will be needing a any glue I like Elmer's um the brand of Elmer's and I'm just using the gallon you guys will need water, but water is optional. You guys can use any coloring, food coloring, acrylic paint, or anything. Doesn't really matter, but this is optional too. You'll be needing something to mix in, something to mix with, and slum borax. So let's just get started with this video. So the first part you'll be needing will be the these two things. Something to mix in, something to mix with, and your glue. The second step will be adding water, not too much water. Alright, so we just have to be stirring this around. So I just gave you guys a closer view to see what would this look like. And while you're mixing it, your glue and water mixture, sure, sure, what am I saying? Um... They have to turn into this, um, well, it should turn into this, like, foggy white color, and, yeah. After stirring for a couple seconds, um, you should have this, like, glossy color, but it looks like from, yeah, it looks like, um, what's it called? Like, a really glossy white liquid, and, yeah. So once you add the water kind of stirring, it should turn to this like foggy color until you have this. And that means it's ready. So I am going to add the acrylic paint um, while I'm finished making my slime. And this is why because um, when I was making this metallic slime, it's not really a metallic. But it is metallic, but not really a metallic. But it came out to be not first. It came out to be just a plain slime and then after that playing with it and I saw that I really didn't like the color so I added more paint and it made a metallic more metallic shape to it so I'm gonna let that do the same thing to this one for the neon one but yeah all right so we just have that activator now for the activator I like using one one baby spoon it's about half a teaspoon you can use also one, well, you can eyeball it, and if you guys want to know what that means, that means to, like, I like, a normal, like, a random amount, and just, like, keep stirring it, so I just like doing a little bit little, if I don't feel like, um, if I don't feel like getting my spoon, but I do, I do not have my, um, spray bottle at this moment, and I have, I have it, I have the borax in a um, different container, so um, I just like using spoon when I have it in containers and not my spray bottle. So after stirring, 
you should just you should see their slime forming and I'll give a close up for that. You guys should see your slime actually forming. And you, if you guys see your slime doing that, that means you are doing a good job with this process. Alright, so we just have to keep doing that. And I'm not going to be talking with this process, so yeah. slime should be forming very fastly depending how much activator or detergent or anything you're using for the activator and you guys can see that the slime did get a little bit bigger and I'll be right with you guys after I have it quite ready Now, if your slime is taking a long time to activate, just add a couple spoons or just like a couple of drops, whatever, into your slime and it'll make it faster. Now, keep doing this until the slime only sticks onto your spoon and not to the bowl. My slime, you guys can see, it's only kind of sticking into the spoon. But I'm just going to add a little bit more activator. And if you guys can see, it's only sticking into the um, spoon. That's when you can take out the slime. So before putting your slime down into a, a flat surface, just touch it with one finger and see if it's sticky. If the slime is sticky or sticking to your finger, just add a couple drops of activator or a couple of spoons of activator onto the flat surface you guys are going to be kneading and playing with the slime. So I just gave you guys a better view for you guys to see me be playing with the sign. And yeah. Alright, so when the slime is a perfect texture that you guys like, not too sticky. I like mine's a medium, not too sticky, but kind of sticky. You guys can see. But it's a good texture for me. So we're just gonna um Put some paint and yeah. Before adding paint, I just want to do an ASMR on this white slime. So yeah. So now I am just going to um, add some of the paint, so yeah.
So I do kind of like this slime, but I'm just going to give you guys a really much better view without flash because I have flash on my camera. So yeah. And let's see how it looks like without flash and with flash. So this is how it looks like with flash to just get a good view. This is how it looks like without flash. And I do like mine's kind of sticky. So I think that this slime, well actually the acrylic paint for the slime is a good thing to use. It gives a pop pop up color. But if you guys want to see me do more of the colors, let's give this video into, let's see, how much likes. Um, let's say three or four likes, and we will do the next part of the other set. And I'll probably use all of these 12 colors, and this probably will be part one. But the other one will probably be part two in the same title and everything with this um, neon paint with this metallic them of uh, paint too so they have six of each so six part of six different section of colors so let's do an AM ASMR before we pause this video and then say bye and I'll see you guys for the next video and stuff like that so yeah So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you guys are new to my channel, subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. And again, we have to have at least three to four likes for having a next part of the whole set of the paints and make different colors of the slime. So if we're going to do a next set of the paint, so that means that we're gonna do if we're gonna do another color of this neon set, I'll call the second video um, the same title as this one, but I'm gonna have uh, parentheses neon in it. So yeah, and then part one, and then part two, part three. So this one will just be the original one, and then if you have more than three or four likes on this video, I'll need another one, part one. So yeah. See you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.